Let's write the atomic orbital diagram for titanium, that's Ti. So the first thing that we need to do, we need to write an electron configuration for titanium, and then we'll write the orbital diagram. So titanium, that's right here on the periodic table. And titanium has an atomic number of 22. So it has 22 protons, but it also has 22 electrons since it's a neutral element here. So we have 22 total electrons. To write the configuration, we'll just follow the pattern here on the periodic table. We'll start out in the first energy level. We have 1s1, 1s2, so that's full, 1s2. Second energy level, 2s1, 2s2. We go over to P, we have 2p1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, because P can hold up to 6, so that's full. 3s2, 3p6, let's give ourselves some room here. In the fourth energy level, 4s2, and then we get to 3d12, so 3d2. So we use this to write our atomic orbital diagram for titanium. So both this atomic orbital diagram and then the electron configuration, we're just trying to show where the electrons are around the nucleus of the titanium atom. You can imagine the nucleus down here, and then we'd have these energy levels, kind of think of them as shells around the nucleus. So we have 1s2, put them in opposite directions, 2s2 in the second energy level, 2p6, we spread them out before we pair them up, 3s2, 3p6, 4s2, 3d2. So we'll put those last two here in the d orbital, and this is the atomic orbital diagram for titanium, Ti. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.